the temperatures just are ticking up and up and up. When we're going to start with the map of the day. Uh -huh. 10, 15, 20 degrees it. warmer than yesterday Yay. at this time. There we go. And we're going to be up another, oh, 10 or more this time tomorrow as most of us will be back into the range of 55 to maybe close to 60 degrees tomorrow afternoon. We're up 20 in Terre Haute. It's 22 warmer in Bedford. In Indianapolis, we're 17 degrees warmer from this time yesterday. We had some sunshine earlier today. Clouds on the increase. So over downtown Indianapolis, we'll give you a view of Monument Circle where we currently have 45. That's also the high for the day. Winds are out of the east southeast at 11. 45 after starting the day in the teens. 18 degrees this morning. Sunset for us this evening happens at 621. So we're about an hour away from sunset and it's going to be a nice, uh, relatively mild February evening. We'll be in the low 40s at 8 a.m. tomorrow. More clouds and sunshine and a very windy day for our Wednesday, but it's also going to be warm. We'll spend the afternoon in the 50s. Check out these winds south southwest sustained 20 25 miles per hour, maybe some gusts 40 45 nearing 50. It's the reason for the wind advisory out of the National Weather Service for tomorrow. We're also under a flood watch for Wednesday night all the way through Thursday night thanks to melting snow and rainfall potential of one to three inches. So when does that heavy rain get here? Future Track 13 has us dry tomorrow and tomorrow night. It'll be early Thursday. This is Thursday at 7 a.m. We start to see the heavy rain arrive. I also want to point out you're going to see some pink and blue on the map. This is going to be a, a rain sleet snow mixture once you're north of Lafayette midday on Thursday. That mixture will start to work its way south but right now the big story appears to be that threat for flooding with the heavy rain, although I do think we'll see rapidly changing weather and road conditions as the colder air arrives and we see that flooding rain change over to a mix and then to some snow and obviously that 57 won't last long on Thursday. Falling temperatures we're back into the 30s Friday and Saturday, but I said 60 in the seven day. It's Monday next week.